when you say you don't even believe in God. <laughs> I can't see any relevance unless you are playing a game with us to say you are a confirmed atheist. You just want to put us to the test whether we know our books, we know our onions or not. Right? I think we have answered it. And you, young man, look. You. All right. The next. Baby, you can call me a superman. Chuchu 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 gani taku pama. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. It's your boy Jesse Keegan and your girl Fanny Lungu. And we are Fanny and Jesse. So right about now, we're gonna do another reaction. This one right here was suggested by a lot of people. But before we get into the reaction, guys, we wanna thank everybody for subscribing to our channel. You're the realest time with man. Thank you, thank you so much. And also, you wanna thank everybody who's been giving us reactions. We have a lot of reaction videos. And uh, we're trying to, you know, do them uh, one at a time. And yeah, I mean, that's what we, we want to do for you guys. Anyway, today we're going to do another reaction. And this one right here, we're going to do... Uh, this one was suggested again with, by... Uh, this one was suggested by a lot of people. Like, a lot of people suggested this video. Two of us. Yeah. A lot of people actually suggested. And they decided... Uh, they suggested that we should go react to the dad at his best part two. I don't know why people love this guy so much, but probably it's because of his teachings. Maybe. Probably it's because of his teachings. He has good teachings and stuff like that. So without any further ado, guys, let's get it. This is the most unjust thing to do. Can you imagine you go and commit all the crimes in the world and we catch the most innocent man that we can find and hang him? You think God Almighty is such is such a person, is such a being, that for Adam's sin, Adam and Eve, they had the fruit, and now he's going to put everybody into hell, and he's going to take his own son, an innocent child, who had done no wrong, and have him hanged, and his poor man doesn't want to die, he's crying, sweating blood, and you know, never mind, who come to get him hanged, is that God, is that a loving God? You are a loving father to your child, I take it, if you have any children. And for somebody coming, you know, committing a crime in your house, you going to kill your child for somebody else's crime? Is that what you do because you love this criminal so much? All these sinners? Yes, man. Yes, man. Muslims get together, set aside that minute difference 
fishing in troubled waters. You see, this problem you should pose to the Christians because the Muslim has given his hand. Look, he says Jesus is the Christ. The Muslim says that. The Muslim says that he was the Messiah. He says he was born miraculously. That he gave life to the dead by God's permission. He healed those born blind and the lepers. Look, the Muslim is giving his hand of friendship again and again and again. Now this question of yours, this good spirit of yours, you should spend, expend it on your Christian friends. Ask them that look, since the Muslim is coming forward, why aren't you prepared to give your hand of acceptance and say, look, we also believe that Muhammad is a messenger of God. And you, 1,200 million Christians and 1,000 million Muslims get, can get together on a common platform. Now, do that service for mankind. Ask your Christian friends. <laughs> Oh, I see, right? Now. What do you think? Ah, <clears throat> um, he's an interesting guy, actually. Um, I think that's why, the reason why people like him is because of his teaching and also he's, uh, he's somehow funny, you understand? He brings, uh, he brings in some humor in it and stuff like that. And, uh, okay, according to what they were discussing and what they were talking about, the guy who asked the question really asked a very important question. Very important question. Why don't why don't this religion, Christian and Muslim, just come together and just uh, like uh, just come together and teach people uh, one commonality, probably uh, the ways of, of of God and stuff like that. You get it? You understand? Instead of just having this um having their own ways and having uh this one having their own ways that's going to bring a lot of confusion why don't they come together and you know uh, admit that okay fine we understand we have muhammad on this side we have uh, jesus christ on this side but can can we just try and make it uh unify it and make it just you know uh, one thing and be able to to uh to conform to one one particular god or stuff or stuff like that. I mean that I mean the guy had a point, but again Ahmed did that what he said also meant uh, uh, I mean um, was also a good point. What do you think? What what Ahmed did that say? Yeah it was good points but then I'm thinking do you think that it's only Christians with the problem? No I don't think it's only Christians. Maybe there are some Christians who have problems, and also there are some Muslims too who have problems because. Uh, it's not. I'm not think. I'm not going that deep. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying, why not accept each other? Mm -hmm. You believe in God. We believe in God. We're cool. But but don't you? Do you think even if we we believe in God, we believe in God that's cool, and then. Uh, it's about respect. Yeah. So you think this thing of unifying each other is not good, like coming together? No, it is good. That's it's what should be happening. Like you said in the beginning, this guy had some really good questions, not just the second one. Mm -hmm. I mean, the second one was like, hmm, at least someone is asking something smart. Mm -hmm. Both of his questions were quite smart, and I like the way Didat answered his question. Yeah, he answered really well, actually. People should really put these things to the test. Get this Muslim friend of yours, get this Christian friend of yours, get them together, see where it goes from there. Yeah. But he said like Muslims already reached out their hands. Like he said, it's not everyone that's mm. open. It's quite, you people can actually see it for yourselves in our comment section below. Christians are saying, I don't understand why you're reacting to this. This is, how do I can I use the equate? Not bad. Okay, let's use bad. That's the safest way. This is bad. We've got Muslims saying because we're not Muslims, these people are just doing this for what? To get gain subscribers. Such things. But okay, I I, I wanted to ask one question. If um, if we believe you see the way God, you do see? you believe in God and we're doing we're reacting to this, so yeah. what's the problem? Why can't you let us learn at whatever pace we want to learn is what I'm trying to say. 
if there's Christians out there that are coming across these videos, why just not watch it without even judging? Some people just see the title and they're already there writing paragraphs of bad things. There's nothing that you gain at the end of the day. You believe in God, we believe in God. Yeah. Everyone believes in you know, um, God. To be honest with you guys, the purpose of this uh, channel was to do reactions. Reac yeah, reaction and vlogs, you get it. This channel was not to actually react to Islamic videos like throughout. Any type of reaction we are good to do that, but we have a lot of Islamic videos and we cannot just leave suggestions. Yeah, sorry, suggestions. And we cannot let that slide just like that. We have to do reactions for those for, for those videos. We also have videos for uh Sanguru. Because at uh, the end of the Hinduism. day we're saying give us any reactions you yeah. want us to do and we'll do it for you so if someone suggests something we do it and yeah. we let people this is what people want yeah it's like it's like it's a um, it's on demand yeah it's on demand and people want us to react to to uh to this type of video so it's not we well, i don't know when people talk about views and everything we don't we don't really don't care about the views and whatnot all we care about is are you getting the message are you happy? Are you entertained? Are you happy with the way we reason? And are we you learning get it? something at the end of the yeah, day? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Everything are you is like, give and take. Yeah, give and take. It's a win-win situation. You get it? Are you winning? If 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 you wanted to do these two things for view or any uh, any other thing for views or stuff like that, you would have actually you know decided to do other things because there are some other videos out there who can give us even more views. You understand? But then that's what I'm saying. If we're going to look at this message and apply it to us, it all comes down to love yeah. and respect. Yeah, true. You believe in God, we believe in God. Appreciate what we're trying to do. We may not do it your way, but we're doing it the best way that we can. At the end of the day. If we want to learn. Yeah, true. If we really want to learn, it's about you. If you want to support, support us. But there's mm -hmm. some people that will just type something just to spoil. Yeah. Try to spoil our day. Come on, guys, man. Let's 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 be happy people. Let's be uh, respectful people, and we are here to make videos for you guys. We have, I mean, we are, we are here to make videos for you guys. It doesn't matter whether we are whether we are Christians, whether um, agnostic, whether what, Buddhist. yeah, whether Buddhist, whether Hindus. Everybody has a has a what has a story to tell, and probably this is our story that we are probably it's leading us to these uh, videos that we're trying to react. Imagine just a small video like this separating us. You've mm -hmm. never met us, you don't know anything exactly. about us, but you feel the need to judge. Exactly. We, some of these things should actually bring us together. We shouldn't judge each other despite the fact of, the I mean, on the video that we're trying to do. Get it. Let's not judge each other. Let's try and act right. Let's try to respect. If you, if if it doesn't go with your, with your what, with your um, what do you call it? If if it doesn't go with what you like, you can decide to skip the video. It, it, it's as simple as that. Decide to skip the video. No, wait but for I'm the. I'm saying yeah. according to this video. Yeah. People should accept us for us. We should accept yes, yes, for them. True. True, yeah, true. At the end of the day, like we said, we are willing to learn. Are you willing to teach if you know something better than us? Yeah. I like there's some people in here who are actually really uh, informative. They, they give us yeah. they give us really some good information. Some people actually take time to explain something. And it's really nice. Is this is this guy called Arif? Is it 19 or something? Oh, I just know it's Arif. Yeah, Arif from uh, I think the United States. I think they should be uh, on objective as well. Yeah, I mean there are a lot of people. Uh, recently he gave out a very good point about uh, chopping off of hands and stuff There's like that. There's another one. Really, really amazing. What is the name? Shout out, but to, shout out to all of you. Yeah, everybody. You the real estate MVP man. Still Thank you so winning. much. But uh, apart from what we just talked about, I wanted to ask about... Um, uh, what, what is it? A very important point. Okay, do, do you like like the way um, uh, like Isa or maybe Jesus was mentioned in the, in the Quran, yeah? Why is it that in the Bible we don't emphasize so much on Muhammad since Muhammad was mentioned in the Bible? I don't know, but I feel like the fact that he's mentioned that should stand for something. It doesn't matter mm -hmm. whether he's emphasized or not. Mm -hmm. 
there's a reason okay. why Muhammad is mentioned in the Bible. Just yeah. take that little bit. Okay, so like you should people should think like that and take interest. How come this person is only mentioned yeah. one? Okay, what yeah. did he do? What did he what do? Was, what Let was me go his deeper and find out. Yeah, that's yeah. true. Anyway, guys. Thank you so much. If you feel like you reacted to this video in a better way, just give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to go down in the comment section tell us exactly what you feel about our reaction. What you feel about uh, this video right here of uh, the Dutch uh, at his best part 2. And uh, yeah, I mean, such a good guy, such a humorous person. He has really good teaching. And personally, I feel he's, he's just an amazing person. What do you think? I feel like he's... Um you know that just those great teachers in this world. Yes, yes, That's yes. what he is. Uh, amazing. Teachers. Yeah, you can easily fall in love with what he's teaching. I don't think people would even have a hard time converting if they just listen to him. Yeah, yeah, I true. think he's one of the best we've come across. Yeah, true. Anyway, guys, and the most important thing is don't forget to subscribe to our channel. The more you keep on subscribing, the more you give us the motivation to do a lot of videos and to give us a better, better content. And last but not the least, we're going to see you in the next video. And peace out.